I'm looking forward to celebrate Pentecost with you this Sunday, the celebration of the Spirit of God coming into the disciples' hearts in their lives, the Spirit of wisdom and understanding, the Spirit of counsel and might. And God knows and we all realize just how much we need this Spirit right now, especially in our beloved country. The breath of life, as the Holy Spirit is also called, is at the forefront of our needs today. As a respiratory disease, COVID-19 has brought prayers for oxygen and air to the forefront. Everyone in lockdown is seeking fresh air and breathing space. And after hearing Mr. George Floyd shouting, I can't breathe, before his killing this past Monday, we all are gasping for justice. Today I was planning to alert us to the second curve of mental health needs after the first curve of the medical urgency in this COVID-19 crisis. Our country is clearly in need of mental health and of an intervention of sanity and healthy justice. Repeated killing of African-American citizens by the civil force of government responsible for the public order must stop. I have reached out to our brothers and sisters of our New Haven churches and houses of worship calling for a common sign on our buildings that shouts Black Lives Matter. I invite you to join me in prayer to consider calls to action for justice and sanity. During this viral crisis, we all realize how much we need more love, more mercy, more justice, not less. So let us pray that the Holy Spirit of wisdom and understanding comes in our hearts and returns in the soul of our country. Let us join each other for prayer for the Holy Spirit this Sunday. I look forward to seeing you.